again. Well, we got another piece of found media. Your mind's gonna be blown away with this one. Let's see it now. I do recall seeing this on TV many, many years ago. I still can't believe it was even considered as lost media. And that is my special book. How special? Hi, I'm Book Girl, and this is my special book. And I want it to be your special book too. So come on in. A tiny girl inside a book? Sign me up and let's watch it! It's story time! It's story time! And I hope you're ready to hear a story because I am just bursting to tell one. Yeah, yeah! Let's have some fun! Let's hear a story! The question is though, which one do I tell? There are so many stories. Really? It's near bedtime. Maybe I could do a bedtime story. Okay. Hey, book girl, there's someone at the door. Maybe they have an idea. Open it, open it. Thanks, doorbell. <laughs> Whoa, the doorbell is sentient. I didn't see that coming. Get comfy, find your listening spot, and let's have some fun. Yeah, that's just what I said. Once upon a time, there was a little girl named Paka. Paka was a normal girl in every way, except one. You see, every time Paka sneezed, he didn't just go, achoo. No, every time Paka sneezed, a kangaroo jumped out of her nose. Oh, a kangaroo out of her nose? Now that's something you don't hear every day. A kangaroo out of her nose? That's silly. Oh my goodness, now we have a sentient alarm clock. Okay then, continue. Paka was a little bit messy, and her room was covered in dust. Oh my. They were jumping on the bed, and a big cloud of dust blew up. And you know what happened next? Oh, I do. Achoo! And another kangaroo appeared. Achoo! Another kangaroo. Achoo! 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 So many kangaroos! And if you think one kangaroo likes to jump, a hundred kangaroos like to jump a hundred times more. Every time the kangaroos jumped, the house jumped. Every time the house jumped, there was more dust to make Paka sneeze. And every time Paka sneezed, a toe, there was more kangaroos. And then? Well, I think you understand. Yep, more kangaroos galore. So, if you see a little house bounce by with a little girl inside, that's Paka. The funny little girl who should have cleaned up her room. The end. Well, that was a funny story. Well, let's listen to another one. We have time. Hi, story stuff. Oh, sorry, book girl. I'm very sleepy today. Oh, well, sleepy or not, we need a story. It's story time. Yeah, come on. Chop, chop. Let's go. It's still story time. So what do you suppose is in there? Looks like a seed or something. I wonder what it could be. Hmm. I think it's a pea. That's what this is. It's a pea. You mean we're going to hear the story of the princess and the pea. Get comfy. Find your listening spot. And let's have some fun. Mm -hmm. Once upon a time, there was a prince who lived in a castle. He wanted to get married, but only a princess could marry a prince. Hmm. Well, nowadays, that could be optional. My friend Peach is a princess, and she absolutely loves Mario. And he's not a prince. But that doesn't matter, as long as they love each other. And they do. And this prince had fallen in love with a servant girl. No son of mine shall ever marry a servant girl, said the queen. If I can find a way to prove that she is as delicate as a princess, will you let me marry her then? Very well, said the queen. Uh -huh. She took a pea and slipped it underneath the mattress of the servant girl. Oh, oh my! Ha, you will never marry my son. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, um, we'll see about that. My son wishes to marry you. I wish to marry him too, said the servant girl. He is my true love. Yes! And when I looked to find out what was causing my discomfort, I found this. Oh, <gasps> it's the pea! She has passed the test, said the prince. I will now marry my true love. Yeah! And he did. The end. Oh, that is so sweet! I loved that! Once upon a time, right here in 
my special book. Bye-bye. 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 See you soon in the next What's About a Time. Well, that was my special book. And I, uh, well, <laughs> it was really interesting. I still can't believe that this was even lost media to begin with. Well, I'll see you soon. Tone it sudden off.